Hello everyone, John McNamara, Highball Advisors, and today's question and answers comes from uh, Rhonda, and she has a question around eligibility for the railroad retirement annuity. So I work for the railroad, and at one point it's brought up where I have never gotten a credible answer. So let's hopefully I can help her out here today. What if someone is vested but gets terminated? Say they have 20, 25 years with the railroad, can, uh, can he or she still get an annuity? I've had people tell me that they must be in good standing with the railroad, and if they are terminated, the person terminated will not qualify for a railroad annuity. Well, you know, I get this actually a lot from people, and it's, uh, I think what happens is there's a confusion uh, amongst railroaders uh, when it comes to current connection, right? They hear this term current connection all the time, but that really relates to uh, the disability annuities and the survivor, uh, survivor annuities, right? So that's a current connection. Otherwise, if you've worked for the railroad for five years after 1995, you can never lose your railroad retirement annuity. And it's 10 years before 1995. Uh, you've always paid into it. Uh, you can't take it away. Just imagine working for a company and then say, oh, by the way, uh, we're gonna let you go and you can't collect social security. Use the same mentality. You've paid into it all these years. You always will get your railroad retirement, assuming you're vested. So um, check out my video uh, I have on YouTube on current connections. Just it, that will make clearer uh, the distinction there and help explain a lot of things. Uh, in the meantime, please send in your questions to uh, john at highballadvisors.com or put it up on my YouTube channel, and uh, maybe I'll do one of your questions next. All right, everyone, please stay safe and uh, stay on track. Take care. So long, everybody. Bye.